Hey, what's up guys? We're going to be doing a deck profile for the Divine Judgment of the Spellbooks Turbo Edition, which is the uh, deck I uploaded, uh, did a video of it um, a while ago, and uh, everyone's been wanting the deck profile, so I'll give it to you guys. Um, I'll put a link in the description if you guys want to see how the deck plays and how broken this combo is. Uh, keep in mind, this effect can change, as uh, Divine Judgment doesn't actually have its print out yet, and it doesn't even have like the, uh, the, t the OCG print uh, actually out. Uh, so yeah, keep in mind this effect can change, and that can change uh, how good spellbooks will be because this makes them like really derpy. But uh, that said, let's get started with the deck profile. So uh, playing triple high priestess, uh, two breaker, uh, three dress of prophecy. Choose the card that you bring out during the end phase with divine judgment, and then uh, triple uh, spellbook magician of prophecy. Um, and he's used to just add this to your hand or add whatever you need to like start your deck going. And then heavy storm, and then triple uh, spellbook power. Uh, Dark Hall, 3 Spellbook of the Master, uh, 1 Eternity, you could probably just drop this card um, if you wanted. Uh, triple Upstart Goblin, because it is a turbo variant and it does count as a spell card, so you just add more, right? Um, I'll play Reborn and I'll play 3 Spellbook of Secrets. Uh, keep in mind, some of these pictures, it'll say like Grim Book of Spell, but look under it where it says Card Info, that's the actual card name. Um, some of them is just because like the way that the, the images came out for uh, on DevPro. Uh, then two duality because like you want to be able to like get this first turn and here's the, here's divine judgment which is like the broken card and then uh, two spellbook of wisdom and then two spellbook of fate uh, during the end phase you can chain these keep that in mind because uh, you can just flip him back face down and then uh, triple uh, spellbook of life oh, I'm sorry double spellbook of life and we're playing two of the the spellbook tower as far as the extra deck which I actually saved in the wrong section last time I saved it in the side deck. So you don't actually get to see it in the, the video, but it's not like you really need the extra deck anyways, other than Big Eye. But I, I will mouse over them really quick, just in case you uh, were curious uh, what there was. <laughs> Random Red Dragon Archery. It's because if I reborn a Valor, that's why the, the tuners, oh, I'm sorry, the uh, Synchros are here. So uh, that's the deck profile. Um, if you guys want to see how it plays and how broken it is, just uh, view the uh, description box below and you can see how it plays. Uh, just play it, you know, once or twice just to see how good it is, and you'll just realize it's kind of broken. Um, I, I, I just don't want you guys to keep on playing this, this deck over and over while this is here, because you'll learn that spellbooks um, are very derpy with this card, and they, they shouldn't be as derpy. And I don't think spellbooks will get touched, because they're still printing out more of these cards. But uh, that said, I hope you enjoy the deck profile, have some fun, maybe one or two games. Just don't keep on spamming this deck over and over, because... Um, this card could change, and then you'll if you uh, invest into these cards, you could definitely lose a lot of money, uh, especially if Divine Judgment isn't as good as uh, it is currently. But anyways, thanks for watching. Asianize signing out.